No, no, parang sana makita ng mga tao that we can all relate to uh, Manny V. Pangilinan. Napakabigat pakinggan. No? Uh, but the title of the book is Extraordinary Manny. Maybe you could give us an insight. Eh? Kasi when you tell me that uh, maybe kids, when I was a kid, I could have related to... I, honestly, I, I wasn't extraordinary at all. I was the opposite of extraordinary when I was in grade school and high school. Was he extraordinary nung bata pa? Well, um, in the start of the book, his dad offhand uses the word extraordinary. And it was also a word that I found quite weird uh, when I was younger. <laughs> uh, because ordinary means ordinary, but extraordinary means something magnificent. Mm. Uh, we don't, you know, and we kind of get into the anatomy of the word. Uh, he asks, well, what does extraordinary mean? Mm. Uh, is, does that mean very ordinary? or you know something more than ordinary uh, and uh, we, we kind of tackle that but the idea is that uh, well spoiler alert for you know for, for people reading the book or people who want to read the book um, but it's really that whatever we see of MVP is always quite extraordinary uh, it's always quite like he lives in a world that's different from us but the reality is that uh, I work as his assistant now. I see, I see him every day. And uh, before I worked with him, I, I, I would fantasize with my friends. What would you do if you suddenly became rich? And um, we, we've all had that conversation. And watching him, a rich person, uh, this is what, exactly what he would do when he would become rich. And the answer is to work and to aspire more. And you know to work even harder. He didn't really change over the years. Uh, his habits. When he was a kid, he felt like he was ordinary. So he wanted to be extraordinary by doing that little extra. He would spend extra time in the library instead of playing games. Uh, he would study extra for his exams. Uh, he would give extra time for his work, and it always pushed him a little bit further. Gave him that little edge. Mm -hmm. And to this day, you know, even when he's achieved. Uh, perhaps what many of us set out to achieve, he still does the exact same thing. Uh, to him, it's really the work. And like I said, it's one kind of life, and it's a remarkable life. And we wanted to you know, show kids that this is one way to aspire for greatness. Not the only way, but one good way. Uh, What's the secret? Meron ba yung ano, yung sipag at syaga yung isa eh? <laughs> Sa kanya naman, ano yung kanya? Doing extra. Doing extra, um, going the extra mile. Yeah, going Ayan. the extra mile. So we really kind of mangled the meaning of the word extraordinary. Uh, and we started saying, no, he studied extra hard for math and extra hard for science and extra, extra, extra hard for economics, um, hmm. which was the study of making the most of what you have. Hmm. So it's really kind of repetition. I, I kind of channeled how I talk to my nephews and nieces. Uh, 